Hey butterflies, it's your girl Kay, and today we're going to talk about these lashes, baby. Let's get into them. Which way do you like to wear them? Full strips or individual lashes? Okay, so let's get into this video. So right now, I'm barefaced. Forgive me. Um, as you can see, I ain't got no makeup on, no eyebrows, it's hit. And I'm introducing you guys to my lash brand, Crazotic Touch, which is Crazotic Lashes. Crazotic Touch is my brand, which I sell lashes, t-shirts, and all that kind of good stuff. So those are my lashes right there. Those are the CEOs, which is so cute and full crisscross. And these are my hypnotic ones. I love them. They're full length, full flare, and they're wonderful for events. I wear them a lot. Now, these are somewhat my everyday Miss Crazotic because I love the pivots and divots in them. And those are Queen Flutter, honey. Those is when you want to get that money from that man, baby. Throw them babies on and they guaranteed to make it well, honey. Yeah, so we about to get into this. I'm about to throw some brows on so it can at least look like something. This is my first time trying this strip versus individuals. So what I did was took one of my strip lashes and I'm going to cut them into individual pieces so I can put them underneath my own lash like you would get done at the shop. So I'm about to take this lash and cut it up. I'm about to show you where and how I'm cutting it. As you can see the little splits, how they separate. I'm gonna get my scissors in between that and just clip it and then make it one lash, one little individual lash. And I'm going to take a minute to do this. And then I'm going to show you right after that how they become the, like the individual lash. And then I'm going to apply them. So you can tell me which ones you like. Um, well, you'll see what I'm talking about when I get to that part of the video. But I... Made a little boo-boo. So I am going to do this video over again. And that time it'll be better because I'm going to practice on how to, you know, actually put my individual lashes back on. I used to do it all the time, but I haven't done it in so long because I'm using the strips. But, yeah, I'm going to do this video again. But you'll see where I'm talking about. But, okay, you can see how I cut it. And it became like pretty much an individual lash. So what I'm going to do is put the strip on the right side and the individuals on the left side. So for you guys, it would be vice versa, I guess, if you're looking. And you can tell me which one you guys like best. Excuse me. I didn't really do a pretty good job with my eyebrows like how I wanted to. But, you know, experience on camera is best. So, you know, I had to get off camera to sort of kind of clean them up and fix them. But you'll be able to see a little bit of that part too. But here, yeah. Try to tackle these brows that need to be badly um, waxed along with that over lip mustache child. So I'm definitely looking for products for my skin because I'm really having this really bad breakout. Oh, that's my favorite mirror. Oh my God, I got that at a business event that I attended to, like this blip. Big block party, you can vend. So I vended my lashes and my t-shirts and stuff. And this girl had these mirrors. So I bought one. I love it. I use it all the time. But yeah. 
I'm about to get into these browns. But as I was saying, I want something that I can cleanse my face with every day. My skin's so sensitive. I got mixed skin, oily and dry at the same time. It's oily in some spots, dry in the other. But if you guys have any recommendations, please put in the comments below. Also, subscribe, ring that bell. If you have any questions, comments, any tips, I'm willing to listen. So please put them down in the comment. I do respond to my posts. So watch what you say. Okay. Thank you. So we about to get into these brows, honey, because they is toe up from the flow up. But I'm doing the best I can with them just for this tutorial. But how many of you um, ever cut the lashes into strips like that? Because personally for me, I just learned that. I don't know how long it's been going on and who first put up a video about that, but hunty, okay, let me tell you, I'm going to be doing all kinds of things with my lashes. That's just another step to add to my repertoire. Um, I was so happy to see it, but then when I cut them, also when you do cut them, I would say cut them cut one at a time and then put them on because also where I messed up at was I didn't follow which ends were shorter and which ends was longer. So I wound up kind of missing, mixing them up on the individual side. So it was going to look kind of wonky, but it's a learned experience. So when I do my next video, what I'm going to do is cut one piece at a time and just place it. I'm going to start with the outer and then work my way to the inner. So that's really going to, you know, balance me out. You guys have to excuse me because I have a little cold. <coughs> I need to clear my throat every so often. But, yeah, so we jump right into it. You see them brows and some what done. Okay. Mm -hmm. So the full one that's fully done is the strip. By the time I got done this video, it was like almost 40 minutes. So I had to cut extensively because I don't want you guys to be on here all day trying to see this. So hopefully you know how to put on individuals. If not, I do a little 10 minute tutorial, five minute tutorial or something like that. But it's thousands of tutorials on YouTube. I'll add one to my uh, channel in a little bit. But yeah, you can see me putting it underneath my lash. Since I didn't do it in a long time, that's what made the video so long because they kept falling off and I wasn't letting the glue dry or something. It was getting in my eyes and chow. A whole hassle for y'all. Just to do this for y'all, for you guys. How much I love my butterflies. You know, got to bring y'all out y'all cocoon so y'all can fly. It's beautiful colors. Okay, so I'm going. You know, from here it's looking a little okay, you know. But I ain't see when you get that close up. But as you guys can see... Before it just jump to the next clip, as you can see, um, how the lashes go unevenly. Now, if you want, you could cut on one by one and strategically place the short and long pieces. That way you can make some type of flare, flare design. But I didn't do that. I just made the mistake of just cutting it up and just putting it on. So then I had one of the longer pieces, so I decided to cut it. Bad idea. Ooh, runny nose. Mm, get them, girl. Get it, girl. Get them, get them, get them, boy. Okay, so I decided to cut it. And this is the outcome. But overall, when I close my eyes, I pretty much, I got a little glue on the lid. You know that tend to happen from time to time. 
The strip looks best to me only because I fucked up the other side. But when I do this video again, the individual is going to have a fair chance. You know, there I am trying to fix it, trying to make it look like something. Also, as you're going along with the individuals, as they're drying, make sure you press them down to your lash so they're tight. And if you use the right glue, they should at least last you for a week, possibly. I don't have no lashes, so mine's only going to be there for a few days. But see, it do not look too bad. It's just the actual flare is messed up. See, it's supposed to look sort of something like the strip, but individual style. But you know, your girl here to live and learn. So, that was my mistake. I'm just going to add some little mascara down at the bottom. Mommy, you doing? Look at that lip. Child, that mascara face is priceless. You can get some money and last off that, honey. Yes, but look at them bottom lashes. I'm going to try some um, bottom lashes. I never wore them before, but... For my photo shoot, for my lashes, I think I'm going to try them and see how they look because I'm going to get myself full glam. I'm going to beat myself to the gods. Yes, honey. You know when somebody in your peripheral, girl, but I'm still getting that fucking bottom lash though because I'm like, who in the world is that? Oh, okay. I didn't even know you was here. <laughs> Yes, baby. So I'm just getting that bottom lash together. Try to make it look like a little something, something. And I had so much confidence in my little look. I went outside like that, okay? I don't know how bad I got talked about, but... Indeed. Indeed, indeed. So, for this video, for me, the strip wins... And them dry ass lips getting some treatment. And next time I will definitely promise to give the individuals a fair chance. Okay? Because they did not have a chance in the world once I cut that lash, honey. I should have left that joint where it was at. I placed that one too high on the end. But my strip came out flawless. As usual, because <laughs> that's just what they do. But I'm not taking away from the individuals because I do like the look it gives my eyes if it was done correctly. So we'll be in the kitchen stirring the pot again, honey. We're going to get it right next time. But I'm going to take the time to tell you guys, please subscribe to my channel. I will try to bring you videos at least once a week um also i have all in all in your business channel where i talk about how to start your own business how to make passive income so when i get to that um i'll leave a link below when i start putting videos up it's probably some already up those are my ceo lashes again my queen flutters. Those are beautiful. I love her. Oh my goodness. www.crazyoticTouch.com. Head over to my website, order some lashes, tell a friend 20% off if you sign up with your email. So at the moment, um, I believe. I only have four lashes up because I'm out of one. That was Miss Crazotic on the scene, honey. Doing her one thing. One time. The lashes that I have on. Um, which ones did I use? Oh, forgive me. Mm, that is a business flow, honey. But it was the last ones anyway, so they're not on my website. The ones that sold out, those are the ones that I use when you go head over there. Or I'll leave 
the name in the description below. Also, um, what else, what else, what else? Follow me on Instagram, underscore crazotic, underscore touch. I am on Facebook too, crazotic touch. Um, am I forgetting anything? So just, yeah, leave your comments below and let me know what you want that next video to be about.